children and the future of the world. What I usually do on my off days, I do as many hospitals as I do concerts. I do as many orphanages as I do concerts. But because it's good news, the press don't cover it. They want bad news. But I do it from my heart. I don't do it to wave a flag and say, look at me. We bring bags of toys and posters and albums. And you should see how it transforms these kids. They jump up and down, and they're so happy. This is Lisa Marie and myself at a hospital in Budapest. And I saw this little kid. His, his name was Farkas. He was very sick. He was green in the face, but he had this, this glow and it's just sparkling in his eye. I asked this nurse, what's, what's wrong with this kid? She said that uh, he needs a liver. So uh, I said, does that mean he's going to die? She said, yes, he's going to die unless he gets a liver. I said, I'm not going to let him die, this sweet, sweet angel. No matter what it takes, I'm going to find a liver for him. So I sent my organization around the world. We went all over the place, and it took a long time. And I said, I'm not giving up. I'm, I'm not going to have this child die. I was so happy when I got a phone call. They told me we found the liver, and he has his life. And I'm so proud that I could help him. God bless him. I love you, Farkas. Coming up, a road trip through the deep south with the Jackson family. And there's Michael there looking for junk. One of Michael's short films gets completely out of control. Yes. <laughs> Elizabeth Taylor gives us a rare glimpse of her special friendship with Michael. It, we have to explain the joke. Plus, life at home for Michael's children without the masks. All when Michael Jackson's private home movies returns. tape that was really exciting because uh, in truth I didn't even know it existed anymore. In between the tours we had a break and my brothers and I took my mother to Alabama to visit her stepfather. We're on our way to Alabama. That's right. Salvation Army tomorrow, Bill. <laughs> Really don't laugh, you're fine, because stuff. <laughs> Don't you, Tito? <laughs> and other places would sell real expensive. Tell them, You're going to be hitting them soon with the depressing things. <laughs> I love going to the Salvation Army, because I find things that I haven't seen since I was little. There's Michael over here looking for junk. They know I like to go through everything. I'm very curious. I go through drawers and go through everybody's closets. I don't steal, but I like to look and explore. But what they got in there, Mike? It's maybe moon Marlin. Okay. <laughs> south, baby. I love seeing the old colonial homes in the South. I had set this shot of me and my brothers walking down. <laughs> I have a film camera in my hand. Fellas! I'm George. This is my mother in the front, and the lady behind her is my mother's stepfather's mistress. Right. <laughs> I'm Georgia. She's funny. That's me. Look at the shacks. I love this. Hiding behind his mom. Hey, Jacksons, turn around. What's smell like beef jerky? We were 
just exploring. They live in those houses, very interesting. Uh, it's a whole different way of life down there. Y'all tighten up. <laughs> we love visiting uh, people we don't know. And we try to get these kids to dance, see? So I do a little step and maybe he would join in. But he, he got a little shy. <laughs> they have per these kids have incredible rhythm, but they were shy in front of us. You kick that thing on me, hard. He was saying, uh, he said, possums are good eating down here, aren't they? They ate possum, but I wouldn't, I wouldn't have any because I knew it was in the rodent family, and they're very cute. They got these little pink noses and big eyes, and they're very inviting. But I wouldn't want to eat one. Papa. Papa. Papa, where you been? That's my mother's stepfather. Papa. Uncle Johnny. I love the way they talk down there. Yeah, you like he's speaking another language, doesn't it? <laughs> sugar babe, need a hand? Oh yeah, sugar babe. She uh, helps take care of uh, Uncle Johnny. She loves to dance. Sugar babe. <laughs> Uncle Johnny is truly a character, and he had this drink called White Lightning, and this drink was so strong, it's, I'm not joking, one sip will get you drunk. It's really strong. My brother Tito took a sip, and he went, wow. You couldn't believe it, but I stayed away from it. But Sugar Babe had some. That's why she was dancing. All right, let's go. Bye, Papa. I seen Georgia there hugging. She was hiding in the house because she told us when it was time to leave that she couldn't take it, and she's crying. So Bill brought her out. It was a wonderful experience. It was just really phenomenal. <laughs> 